The second of two battles in Alcacer started on 19 May 2013, as part of the larger Alcacer Offensive, launched in early April 2013 by the Syrian army and the Lebanese militia Hezbollah, during the Syrian Civil War, with the aim of capturing the villages around the rebel-held town of Alcacer and ultimately launching an attack on the town itself. The region was strategically important as a supply route for rebels fighting Syrian government forces in Homs and also for the Syrian government, as it lies between the capital, Damascus, and the Syrian coast, a stronghold for Assad supporters. Prior to the offensive, the Syrian air force dropped leaflets over the town warning that government forces were going to attack the city. This led to thousands of civilians fleeing, though 25,000 residents stayed. Free Syrian Army General Salam Idris warned of a massacre if the Syrian army and Hezbollah were to take the town. During the final days of the battle Hezbollah forces and rebels negotiated a withdrawal plan, in which the rebels and civilians could evacuate the town through a narrow corridor without being attacked. On 5 June, after two weeks of fighting, the Syrian army and Hezbollah regained control of Alcacer as the last rebel contingents retreated.